Hey folks, this is Mark, your host at Copter's College and Plains RC, Pacific Northwest. I'm out at the flying field here in the car. And I'm going to go fly the helicopter, Blade 230 SV2. I want to tell you about a new project i got coming up, some new content. And it's about the Blade 230 SV2. Uh, uh, you may or may not have uh, seen uh, the videos on my channel, Copter's College and Plains RC, Pacific Northwest. Uh, where I designed and uh, built some uh, floats for my um, 230 SV2. So, uh, and I, th that's been working out great, taking off and landing from the water, and it flies great with the floats on and stuff, having a blast with that. Of course, I already have an 8-light uh, nav light system on the helicopter, so that's also really great. And uh, so the new project is, uh, I got my Axial Crawler recently, a uh, SCX-102. Uh, the 55 Ford, just loving that truck. Oh my gosh, I'm just loving it to pieces. Um, so, and uh, one of the thing I, one of the accessories I got for it is a winch, uh, which is should be here probably pretty soon, probably in a week or less. So I got a really nice, at least it appears to be uh, a really nice winch. It was only 34 bucks. Uh, it's remote control, right? So my new idea is. Uh, now also with the helicopter, the, my blade, uh, 230 SV2, in addition to the floats and the nav lights, I also have her set up so she can do cargo hauling with a sling line or with a hook. She can, I can fly, fly up to something, hover, uh, you know, and hook it with, uh, the hook right from the helicopter and take, you know, fly off, transport it and then set it down somewhere. Or I can use a sling line, which is what they do in real cargo hauling with a helicopter. I've worked in the industry for a fair amount of time, not as a pilot, unfortunately. But uh, it's a line attached to the helicopter, and you attach the line to the load, and the helicopter takes off, picks up the load, you fly to your destination, set down the load, uh, and so on and so forth. So I've been doing that all so far. Uh, so I wanted to, I thought of a new thing that I'm going to do. So I thought uh, related to the floats. So I've got an inexpensive uh, toy-grade uh, RC boat in storage, and I'm going to go get that. still works. And my idea is this. For my next video with the copter and the floats, I'm going to, Start the video running the uh, the boat out into the water, right? And then I'm going to pretend that the boat has run into uh, uh, difficulties and has become disabled in the water, right? And then the Blade 230, the mighty Blade 230 SV2 floats copter will be called in to rescue, right? So what will happen is I'll install that winch with the remote control on the Blade 230 SV2 so that I can fly out to that disabled, you know, RC boat hover over it, I can lower the winch with the remote control from shore on the helicopter while hovering over the boat, right? Down, and then stop at the right place, and then I can hook, you know, the forward railing on the uh, on the RC boat, right? And then I will fly forward with the helicopter using the helicopter as a tow vehicle to tow the boat to shore, right? And then I'll back, uh, back away, from, you know, then I'll move backward, Till my hook disengages from the boat, then I'll use the remote control to uh, to return the uh, the uh, the line and hook right you know back up into the uh, belly of the helicopter, and I fly away and land back again. So there you go. That's my new adventure coming up. And uh, of course, the first I'm gonna receive the uh, the winch. I've ordered it, and I'll do a little video about it, installing it and uh, testing it. Then after that, I'll do the video about the uh, the mighty versatile Blade 230 SV2 rescuing a disabled boat with a winch uh, that, you know, on, on the aircraft, I could lower it and pick up whatever I want to, more or less, and then raise it up. That's going to be cool as heck to, uh, to install, I think, and I think it's going to be cool as heck to, uh, to play with. All right, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Sorry you had to look at my goofy face so long, but uh, I think you're going to enjoy this uh, little project I got coming up. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for sharing the hobby with me, and uh, take care. Bye-bye.